I had this haunting voice in the back of my head. We, a lot of us have it. Yeah. We just ignore it. And it was there for years. So I knew in the back of my mind that I could pull off this whatever. Whatever I wanted, I knew I could. You knew you could. I knew that, but I, I was afraid of the work because I wasn't gifted with brains. I wasn't gifted with God-given talent as far as like athleticism. So I knew to get to where I had to go, to be on the same playing field as these men, to even try out for this program, I knew the work was gonna be something that I didn't wanna even, even attack. So I was just put it off. But yet you did it. Because it haunted me. Okay. The voice in my head said, you know what, man? You're gonna die never even trying to reach your full potential. I believe in a higher power. Don't know the name, don't know where it's coming from, don't know anything like that. But I believe that this power, and visualize me real quick. Let's say it's a man up there, or a woman, whatever, and they have a chart. And when you're born, they say David Goggins, born February 17, 1975 at 6 a.m. They write the chart down because they can see everything. They know exactly what you're fucking supposed to be. They know what you're supposed to be. You die, you go to so-called heaven. You arrive at heaven, I'm 300 pounds. I retired as an Ecolab guy, which is okay. It's just a job, whatever. I go up there and God looks at me and he shows me my chart. And my chart on there says you were supposed to be a Navy SEAL. You're supposed to weigh 185 pounds. You're supposed to be one of the smartest people on the planet, this, this, and all this. You see this. And now you're in heaven, you made it to heaven, but you're like, God, Doug, I was supposed to live that life. I was supposed to live that life. And then you find out that the reason why, because we all think that if we pray on it, if we do this, if we do that, whatever, if we don't work, we just, whatever, it's going to magically happen for us. No. I believe that when I'm all said and done with, my whole job is to outwork the chart. Whatever the fucking chart says about me, the all-knowing power up there, I want to get up there and say, him look at me and say, I know everything. I didn't fucking see this. I didn't fucking see this. I want to feel that. I want to get to the other end of this fucking world and however I'm being judged, whoever's judging me, to look at me and say, I did not fucking no I, I had you at 185 had you at this but all this other shit I was riding as you were living it I want to I want to find more all I can and in that fucking sack of shit you have to dive in that to find more because if you're not willing to go in there and face yourself you're not gonna find anything you can live right here on surface man right here on surface so if there is an ending to this world and there is somewhere to go and there's a judgment, you're gonna get there and you might see a chart and that chart may tell you who the fuck you should have been. And now you get the rest of your life to think about that. Man, I could have lived a much better life if I just would have just suffered a little bit more. If I just would have went in that shit and realized I had so much more, but fear and the 40% and living here versus living here, being afraid, stop me.